offset in plan swift yes you heard it right this is what i'm going to show you today how to measure the additional length offsets you can see a box on the screen it's a five meter on each side imagine you are under some situation where you need two meter on each side so how to get additional if you use the linear tool let me give you the example test so once you're done you'll find out it's only 20 software will not show you by default additional but there is a way as i promised so we'll create a new item give a name test one and how many meters you need additional 1.5 2 3 up to you i need two meter additional so you will see now once i highlight how much it should be it should be overall 28 you can see here how i have done that this is what I'm going to show you in detail. So without any delay, let's get started. Okay, so first thing, this linear will not give you any additional option. It will not cover the requirement offset. We have to create a new template. How to create a template? By clicking on a template tab. You will find here many tabs are already there. If you want, you can create your own tab by clicking here new tab as I have created Saadi and there are few templates. So let's create a new template for offset. So you can click here on segment, give a name offset. So right click in property, advance, name and color, it doesn't matter. One thing matter which is settings, the formula behind. So right now software is giving you takeoff which is a regular length but we need something additional. What's that? It's offset. So click here add property. Software will ask you what's the name. You can type here let's say offset like how many meters or millimeter you want additional. So give a name here offset. Press ok. It's created. Now you want this offset to add in plan shift but we cannot do that directly so we for that purpose we have to create another property click here add property and give a name extra fine it's also created you will understand why i have created this fine now in extra firstly i need section because in plan swift there is section whenever we highlight the length so find out the section as you can see here section count i have find out so i simply need to drag and drop fine it's here now what you want with this section you want to multiply your offset so click here multiply and then offset okay this is the formula for extra now this section multiply by offset you should add in plan shift so click here and add here extra fine this is created now units are fine if you want you can define one time and even later so let's define it now so if we click here okay it's created but we need to do one important setting right click property advance we have to click here offset check now next time software will ask us offset how many meter additional you want plus i'll suggest you one more thing advance form layout and you can click here show unit you can see here software will next time ask units as well okay press ok fine this formula is created go to home tab now you can see here under the templates i have few template and offset test template is also created so i'll simply click here offset to give you the example so it will ask me what's the name i can give a name here lintel so if i know okay the offset of the lintel or some takeoff is additional maybe 0 0.3 or let me just keep it number so it will be easy for you to understand five choose color press okay you will see now by default if we measure regularly it will give us five four times 20 but i added five additional so it should show me 40 let's get the example one two three and four right click and stop you can see here 40 as we expected so this is how plan shift can help us to measure the extra takeoff offset it could be blinding it could be lantern it could be wastage factor it could be any length so concept is same you can create as many formula you want so if you really like the video and learn something new don't forget to subscribe the channel and share your feedback in the comments and if you face any difficulty feel free to contact me on linkedin i'll try my best to help you 
and stay connected because in future I'm going to upload such amazing video to help you guys to learn PlanSip and be expert in software. So that's it for today. Have a good day everyone.